Well, days after Congress Vice President Rahul Gandhi's comment on women in RSS, the RSS has hit out uh, at uh, Rahul Gandhi for his remark. Now, the RSS has said that women in all programs and campaigns in society and women are also participating. Uh, they are also creating an atmosphere of cooperation in families to support. So, in a series of tweets uh, put up uh, by the RSS uh, on Twitter where uh, they have uh, been uh, uh, Taking out, uh, taking on uh, the Congress uh, Vice President Rahul Gandhi, and as far as uh, his comment on uh, women in RSS is concerned, let's get an update uh, from Aditya Nanthanarayanan. We'll go to her in just a bit, uh, but uh, so far uh, the the viewpoint coming in from the RSS side, where they are uh, putting up on Twitter, where in all programs and campaign in society, women are also participating, uh, women creating an atmosphere of cooperation and families to support. And the Shakha work uh, among women is being conducted uh, by the Rashtra Sevika Samiti. Aditi Anantanarayanan back with us. Uh, Aditi, now a strong rebuttal there by the RSS, especially to a very controversial comment made uh, by the Congress Vice President. Yes, absolutely. In fact, the RSS uh, has condemned the statements coming in from Rahul Gandhi. In fact, in this detailed statement also, they have said that even though there are men who work in shakhas, but uh, the RSS tries to connect through these men with the families of uh, all those RSS workers. In fact, also saying that there is a separate wing of the RSS which works only with women and also condemning all the reports that have been coming out, lashing out against RSS, uh, uh, keeping in mind the background of uh, the statement that was made by Rahul Gandhi in Gujarat where he had said that yes. uh, you never find women in shorts in RSS Shakha. So after the BJP had attacked Rahul Gandhi condemning his uh, uh, statement calling it derogatory and insulting for women and for RSS workers. Now the RSS itself uh, coming out and hitting back at Rahul Gandhi.